Sunday. Welcome back. The first 90 minutes has gone. Nothing could separate these two teams. And that means extra time has to be played for. But let me just tell you that the countdown is still on for the million dollars is that Afrizal will be at least identifying who is the winner tonight. It's never too late, 1010. Just keep calling or sending your blank SMSs to 1010. You know that's how to open in the door. And if you open the door, you are in. And if you are in, you could be that winner. But right now, in France, there is no winner to the finals of the 2016 European Championship as we speak. In Saint Denis, the France or the French are on edge. I don't know how to put that to, but I put that to my analysts and uh, pundits here who were able to at least look at this game and how it ended so far. But the upper hand, should I say, belongs to the French. Honorable? Yes, um, the French are. Uh, <coughs> They have got the upper because hand. Because we all know that the more the physical aspect of the player goes down, the more his mental ability goes down also. too. Mm -hmm. So now there is a lot of psychology that has to come here. Mm -hmm. What? How do we approach the extra time? Mm -hmm. We were on top of the team all the time. Now they have dragged us into extra time. They'll be the happiest and most comfortable. Now, what is going to happen? How do we approach the, um, the, 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 the second half? Remember that they still have a one. They still have one more substitution to, to make. be made, mm -hmm. and uh, um, um, Dusham has to be very careful in the way he uses that uh, that substitute. Is he going to bring an offensive player? Is he going to be bring another creative mid player, midfield player? Right. Is he going to come with a defensive midfield player? Go to penalties. Who knows what is what is going on in his mind? Mm -hmm. yeah. um, unfortunately, we can't. We will just try to play with whatever. If, um, does that mean that the upper hand now has been shifted on to the Portuguese because they're able to drag the favourites thus this far uh, um, to the end of the first 90? Well, they, they are dominated in terms of possession and chances created, but if you look at the organisation, lack of concentration is causing them. And the more they tire, the more they lack that concentration. So what, uh, as, the, as the game moves on, without their star player, they have been very, very good defensively. Mm -hmm.